Firstly, Neil, we start with the three points for yourself. Positives to take out the game, obviously the victory and good ball work up to, to the big man Rook. What, what else is there to take out the, out the um, game? I think Charles give the other side some credit, they're nothing to lose, so they've started getting it forward really early and trying to turn us round, so they put us under a bit of pressure, but I think we deserve to win the game and play, as you say, play some good football at times. But I thought our midfield was so much better than Saturday, it was a bit disappointing in there, but I thought Starkey and Newman were excellent tonight. And to be fair, Whitstable got a good midfield, you know, some good players in there. We were after the at the beginning of the season we would have taken 2-1-0, two, two, two wins, so that's the main thing, get the wins, got a clean sheet, probably deserve one Saturday as well, um, so yeah, it's a good start. With obviously the loss of Mark Leverett this season, do you think Starkey for the first two games has come in and he's sort of take, taken on that role very well? Yeah, starting to, yeah, there was a couple of things we wanted to sort out and uh, we had a bit of a moan out about Saturday, but I thought on midfield until say all four of them done well, you know, and uh, there's hard work for him in there, you know, and, and obviously we we invested Jordan in the last 20 minutes, but with other people, people have got to understand now we've got a stronger bench, people are going to go on, aren't they? We set ourselves high standards and I think by the midfield performance tonight you showed what their high standards are and they probably think they can play even better than that now and then the boys in there, so credit to them really. We saw the bigger teams on TV, they even started slowly. Would you would you expect in obviously a slower start towards the start of the season, tempo-wise? Um, I'm quite pleased, I was pleased with the tempo today, I thought it was good, really good, you know, and um, you know, in our past record, the first two games, most only have one point or no points, so to have six points, and we haven't got going yet in some ways. Some things are really good and some things we can do better. In pre-season is always a little bit false. I mean, as a defender, I don't really like pre-season, just tend to come in for criticism and things like that. You just want to get into the real, uh, the real stuff, because then you can start putting your head in there and your tackles in there and the goals count and things like that, and clean sheets matter and stuff like that. So I, I don't think we read too much into it. Six points, so. Obviously, big game Saturday is going to be a tough one against Guernsey away from home. Good to get that one out of the way early? Yeah, I think so, because at least you know it's on, don't you? Or it should be on. So, um, we're later on, you never right. never know, and it could be worse, could be um, midweek. So, no, we're happy. We've got a full, full squad and we're ready to go. Bit yeah, of a strange one, because obviously there's not many games that you end up flying to and things like that. Um, I don't think we've won it there. I think we've got two draws, so we, we want to make sure we can put down a marker and get a win there, things like that. So, yeah. Hopefully we can get a good performance. Like so, obviously Miller who came on today. Mm. Obviously you've also got Stanford on the bench as well. Um, they people that are likely to feature, and obviously as you say, you've got yeah. Stanford bench. Well, yeah, we've got a lot of games. And next Tuesday they've got the League Cup, so a lot of them will get their chance. So um, that'd be up to them to play well to put me under pressure. That's what I want. That's what you want. You want them to come in, play well, and then I've got to go away and think about who I'm going to play.